Hey, what's going on, guys? How's everybody doing today? I'm doing well. Thank you for asking the Body Beat Down here. I'm Michael, at your most humblest service. If you follow my channel, The Body Beat Down, you know that my channel is about health and fitness. Well, mental happiness and just happiness in general is part of that equation. And if you follow my channel, you know what this is, is right here. I don't collect a lot of stuff, but I do collect some action figures from the Netflix, flip, 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 Netflix uh, animated series Masters of the Universe uh, Revelation. The new one coming out next year is uh, going to be Revolution. Uh, it's going to take over where this one left off and hopefully give us some more characters. But uh, uh, this right here is a nice little gift I got myself. Uh, not all at once. The place that I order from a lot is Big Bad Toy Store, BBTS. And you can, uh, they have a thing called Pile of Loot or Loot Pile or whatever. And if you pay for something, you can put it in that pile. If you pre-order something and it comes in, it pays for, you know, it automatically takes money out of your account, puts it in that loot pile, etc., etc., until you get it to where you want it to send stuff. You can send one figure, you can send them all. It, you, you know, you know what I'm saying. Anyway, so I got a nice little bulk load of uh, action figures here to unbox. Six, to be precise. Let's check them out. Let's hope that the boxes are in mint condition because I'm a box collector. And no, I don't have anything against people that like to open them and display them or even play with them. No problems at all. I think uh, life is short and we should enjoy whatever we want to enjoy. As long as it's not, you know, uh, something deadly and hurtful like drugs and alcohol and all that kind of crap. Good slinging and thugging and all that crap. Enjoy yourselves, guys. Okay, it's a nice bubble wrap my grandkids will enjoy. And we got our first figure here. I went ahead and collected this figure because I don't know why. I hate the movie. It was a disappointment when I was a kid. And it's a disappointment still today. But I got the figures because why not? He-Man. From the actual 87 movie. I believe it came out in 87. The movie was a disgrace. It was horrible. The only redeeming factor of that movie is uh, the Skeletor character. Uh, and the guy who played him. He was amazing. He was the only reason to watch the movie. Uh, everything else was a disaster. And it had its reasons that it failed. You can go check that out. Here's a little story right there. Here's... Uh, other figures and you've seen me unbox uh, all these if you've watched my videos so I got this I went ahead and went for it of course I got the Skeletor already the Skeletor what do you got I got the Skeletor alright let's start with this one right here next we have Shadow Weaver now Shadow Weaver is a character from the Princess of Power She-Ra Pop P.O.P. Princess of Power. Uh, I never had this as a kid. I don't. I only had uh, like the Horde. I only collected the Horde uh, when I was a kid. Uh, these days I'm collecting everything because that's what I do. The box has got a little bit of booger on them. Like they've been scuffed from the inside almost. I don't like that. Uh, otherwise it looks pretty good. Of course you got your story down here. Ooh, there's some characters right there. I've already unboxed a couple of those. You need to go check out the videos. So we got Shadow Weaver. Cool character. Cool character. Who do we got here? And this is... I wasn't going to get these, but I thought, why not? Because the show is actually probably getting canceled. It's the other Masters of the Universe. He-Man and the Masters of the Universe. Uh, it's called the CGI. 
a cartoon. It's another one on Netflix. Yeah, they got two on Netflix. It's weird. It's confusing. But I went ahead and I got Skeletor, which is a very beefy, big figure. It's a crazy, it's a way different design. The, the show itself is different. There's gender swapping and race swapping and all kind of different stuff in there, which throws you off a little bit. But it's still a good show and the story is uh, well done. So I recommend watching uh, Revelation and uh, the other one, He-Man Master of the Universe. Also, go back and watch the original from the 80s. Uh, don't watch New Adventure in the late 80s, early 90s. It sucked. Uh, the 2K version that came out in the early 2000s, it's good. Watch that. So that's a good figure. Anyway, see right here, more characters. Of course, get the story and all the box art. The box art on these things is what's pretty cool. See what we got here. Oh yeah. One of the best characters when I was a kid. I really liked him when I was a kid. Manny Faces. I wish he was kind of bigger and bulky like. Like that Skeletor. That'd be cool. But yeah, we got Manny Faces. And of course he comes with a few different uh, masks that you can pop onto his face. And it spins and uh, he can change his faces. Manny Faces. Got the box art back here and all the characters down there that are in this wave. Of course, I got them all now. So, more box art. Many faces. And sorry for the glare. It's really hard, no matter what you do, uh, to try and get a decent image quality on these because of the glaring plastic here. Uh, it's a little difficult. All right. And this here is a, actually a figure that I don't know anything about without having to research. And I did some research. But it was kind of a, a show that came out that was kind of for not black people. But it was for black people. Uh, they wanted to give the black people, I guess, kind of their own hero and kind of their own thing. And so they come up with Sun Man. And Sun Man, for some reason, they went ahead and they put Sun Man and a couple of the other characters from this line into the Masters of the Universe uh, universe. I don't know why they did that, but they did. And I'm okay with it because uh, it's a character I didn't know anything about until I did research and seen that it was available and and all that. So he's a very interesting uh, character. Uh, interesting story. You can Google uh, and you'll get the story. There's a little bit back here, of course. You can, of course, you can't really read it, but Anyway, got a little bit back there of him. So I'm glad to have him. And uh, it was good that, uh, you know, every everybody needs to feel like they can connect with somebody. And sometimes, you know, I guess, you know, you feel like you need to have different characters of different colors, races, ethnicities, whatever, to kind of connect with everybody, I guess. So I'm okay with that. I don't care. And we got the He-Man from the CGI show, just like the Skeletor. We got the He-Man. And uh, again, I collected, I went ahead and got these two figures because uh, there's rumor that the show's been canceled. And I thought, well, I'll give it a little bit of some uh, support and get these couple of characters. I don't know what else I'll buy if they come out with anything else from this show. I don't know. I'll probably buy it. So, the only one I've not bought into yet is uh, the New Adventure He-Man. And uh, I will not buy into the New Adventure He-Man because the show was god-awful and the figures are awful. Everything about it's awful. And uh, I'm not buying into it. Not going to do it, guys. That's the one figure I won't get. And I got another one uh, that was special order. It was uh, time-released. And uh, this box is a little buggered. I don't like that. It'll be alright. Another one that I'm waiting on. Uh, another version of Evil Lynn from the Revelation cartoon. Uh, so I'm waiting on that. And I'm, I'm going to get that in between now and I think it's June. Something like that. But I've already got it and paid for it. And it's just, um, you know, it's one of those things that they release whenever they release them. So, yeah. Anyway... I got six awesome new figures. I'm pretty happy. Uh, I just hate that this box is a little goofy. 
Uh, again, I'm a box collector. But anyway, yeah, stuff like this is, uh, it, it brings joy to me. I enjoy doing it. I don't enjoy spending the money. I'm not going to lie. Uh, they are expensive. And I don't like spending money. And uh, this one here is a little bit boogered. It's like they didn't close the flap all the way. Is what it is, and it's kind of weird. Hmm. Anyway, I'll have to let it slide. That's what she said. So, anyway, uh, if you collect anything, if you do anything like this, hey, let me know in the comments. Uh, again, it's for joy. It, it brings us joy and happiness. And, uh, you know, I never thought in a million years I'd be collecting He-Man figures again. I was an original collector uh, back in the 80s when they came out. I mean, I had everything. So, uh, that's the only thing that I really collected as a kid, really, uh, toy-wise, was all the Masters of the Universe stuff. So, I got rid of that. I gave it all to my nephew when I was 16, uh, reluctantly, at this point, <laughs> many years ago. But, uh, yeah, and over the years, ever since then, you know, there's always that thought, well, hey, maybe I'll get some, maybe I'll do this and that one. And they, you know, each show that's come out along the way or diff different releases of this and that and the other, you think, well, maybe I'll collect them and never do. But once this new show came out, uh, I went ahead and, and I just said, you know what, I'm going to go for it. I'm going to start collecting them and I'm going to get everything that's in this line, this Masterverse, Revelation, New Eternia uh, line, everything that it encompasses, I'm going to try to get as best I can so anyway right now I got a pretty good collection going and this year we have at least about 12 more that's gonna be released at least so gonna have a good little slew of characters guys and once they finally get done releasing them all at some point whenever that is I'll do like a big kinda of showcase and walk you through them all and all that good stuff so anyway guys I hope you enjoy the video uh, please like share subscribe comment all that good stuff too. the body beat down that's me Michael, your happy host. Now I gotta go work out and get my shoulders and my back done. Okay? Get up, get out, get red, do it to it, and we'll see you next time on the Body Beat Down. Get up, get out, get red, and do it to it!